Step 1. Removing the chair. Lift out the main body frame from the packaging carton. Take out the shoulder carton, leg rest, left and right airbags of the seat, back seat cushion, pillow, power cord, hand controller from the main carton. Take out the massage devices of the left and right shoulders from shoulder carton. When you take it out, grab the left and right sides of the shoulder massage device with two hands slowly and put it on the table or the ground. Take out the left right armrest from the box carton. Be sure to hold onto the two sides of the armrest and take them out slowly. The armrest is placed upside down in the box. Place the armrest flat on the ground or the table. Be careful to not to scratch the armrests. Lift out the leg rest from the carton. When lifting, hold the front and back sides of the leg rest with two hands. Step 2. Incline the massage chair to original position. After removing the main body of the chair, take out the power cord and insert one end into the socket on the power box behind the chair and insert the other end into the power outlet. Turn on the power switch located on the power box of the massage chair. The back seat will go up and the seat will go down. After backrest reclines, turn off the power switch, then unplug the power cord. Step 3. Assembling the leg rest. When installing the leg rest to the main body of the chair, unscrew the bolt from hanger on the leg rest. Connect the three air pipes on leg rest with corresponding colored air tubes on the main body of the chair. From left to right, gray, brown, and black. Connect the power line to the power socket tightly. Raise the access cover on the hangers, then raise the leg rest. Attach the access into the hangers on the main body of the chair. Put down the access cover and screw on the bolts tightly. Step 4. Assembling the left and right armrest. Unscrew the bolts that are furthest away from each other. Refer to picture 4. Line up the armrest with the small rod toward the middle of the chair, then slowly push in the armrest. Insert the square tube on the armrest into the side piece of the main seat frame. Slightly move the armrest to make the front and back panels match the bolt holes on the corners of the metal seat frame. Then screw the M6 bolts into the holes. Connect the air hose from armrest to the same colors on the seat. Be careful when assembling the air pipes. Avoid squeezing the air pipes. Step 5. Assembling the left and right side airbags and connecting the remote control. Take out the seat side airbag. Make sure the side with the zipper faces towards the seat. Align the two cylindrical pins to the two holes on the seat frame. Press down straight and make sure the connection is secure. Ensure the air hose connectors and lock hooks are connected firmly. Take out the remote control. Insert the remote connector into the power box socket behind the chair then place the remote into the pocket in the right armrest. Step 6. Attach the backseat cushion and the head pad. Attach the cushion and head pad onto the backrest and connect both parts with zipper and velcro. Step 7. Installing the left and right shoulder massage device. Before installing the shoulder massage device, unzip the bottom position of the shoulder airbag and unscrew the bolt fixed at the inside rear of the armrest. Lift and position the shoulder rest to the inside of the armrest. Connect the speaker wires and air tubes in the shoulder device to the backrest. Match up the axle holes on the armrest with the axle inserts on the backrest. Press the axles into the holes. The two bottom axle holes on the armrest should be aligned with the two inserts on the backrest. Line the top axle to the insert toward the top and twist to secure the, air, the shoulder bag in place. 
After all the holes and shafts are aligned firmly, shift the shoulder device down until it does not move any further. Locate and align the bolt hole underneath the airbags with the bolt hole on the armrest. Screw in the bolt and then zip up the shoulder airbag into the device to complete the installation. Repeat the steps above to install the other side of the shoulder device. Step 8. After assembly. After assembly is finished, please operate the chair in the following order. Plug the power cord in the power box as shown in the picture to the right. Switch on the power on the back of the chair.